We're getting 10 Wi-Fi hotspots into our school today, and these are going to change our students' education. We're hoping that they're going to be able to pair the devices with their Chromebooks, and so every single student at our school will have the ability to complete homework at home. Um, a capstone project is something that the seniors in the International Relations and Leadership Center do, do here, and it's a final way to impact the community one last time in their senior year. So in deciding what to do for our capstone project, we were both in AP Computer Science Principles last year, which is a class where you learn about um, internet security and things like that. And so we learned about the digital, digital divide. And through continued research, we learned that the digital divide is actually, it goes unaddressed in a lot of uh, education systems. So we figured that there was a need at our school for these hotspots and kids that don't have internet access at home. I was excited when our two James River High School students contacted me to tell me about the project that they wanted to undertake because we've been having the same conversations as groups of adults about how do we meet the needs of students who don't have internet access at home. All Chesterfield County middle and high school students have Chromebooks and we've had those now for four or five years. And our curriculum has changed so that they're really dependent upon having those Chromebooks available not only at school but at home in order to complete assignments. Well, we know not everyone in our community can afford internet access at home or the internet access that they do have is tied to one cell phone which may not always be at the house. So having access to the internet helps bring equity into opportunities for our students to learn. As this is a capstone project, some of the capstone projects become legacy capstone projects and that's where a junior from this year decides to take it on for their senior year. So our hope is to be able to advertise this to the um, upcoming seniors so that they'll continue it and right now the data plan is actually for two years so it's already going to be continued next year but ongoing we want a junior to continue it. One of the national providers of hotspots for education is a company called Kajit and so we contacted the company and they were very excited to hear that this was a student driven project and we also partnered with Verizon Wireless. So between uh, Kajit and Verizon Wireless we were able to obtain 10 hotspots and the wireless service that goes with them at a 40 percent discount. These units are really designed for students. They're filtered um, at a high school student level so that they don't get to sites that they shouldn't get to and even cut off at 11 o'clock at night. So we know that they aren't on, on the units through the night. <laughs> we think that our capstone project is important because we're bettering our own high school community and it's kind of like a legacy that we can leave behind for, um, to better students' education within our own community. We're actually having a digital divide auction night here on November 7th from 6 to 8 and we're hoping to raise a lot of money, hopefully we can put forward into future data plans and repairing or repurchasing any devices.